Hello everyone and welcome back to Missile Dine Online Kingdom Hearts 2 The Final Mix here on the PlayStation 4. We are playing on critical mode and we are Sora who wears short shorts. <laughs> Sora does. In the last episode, Roxas became one with Sora. Sora's nobody, Roxas became one with him and we arrived here in the back alley and we met these friends. Hey, uh uh, Olette, Pence, and Andrew Garfield. We met them all sitting here chatting, and now we have free reign to actually explore all of Twilight Town. However, we don't want to head up to the, uh, we can't go to the Station Heights, but we don't want to go to the train station yet. Bring bulk garbage, okay. Uh, apparently we can't enter here yet. I thought we had full reign, but there is so much more that we can find now that we are the one and only Sora. We can actually head over here to the Sandlot and see what's going on. Hey you, where'd you come from? Uh, you here to pick a fight with us or something? Fight? We're not here to fight. Okay, smart Alex. Time to teach you how to behave in my town. Bring it. Man, what a jerk. <laughs> One moment. If you're gonna fight, why not make it a proper struggle? What? You see, Cypher, I'm a really big fan. What? What do you want? In other words, I want to see more of your super cool moves. You handled the tournament with real style. And you absolutely dominated the title match. But I just can't get enough. Don't you see? The matches are far too short. And what's your name? Sora. Sora, if you want to fight a match, you just say the word. Oh. Looks like we can we can fight Cypher. And it also looks like Roxas never actually won, guys. Whether brawling or struggling, I'm not going to lose to the likes of you. Why don't you come back ten years from now? Instant annihilation. I don't know who you are, but you don't stand a chance struggling against Cypher, you know? Alright. Alright. Let's go ahead. Let's actually see if we can get some struggle fights. You're willing to fight? Great! Meanwhile, practice. Wait. You're willing to fight? Great. First, I'd like to test your ability, but I don't have any opponents for you. What? What? Well, that's frustrating. No opponents. Oh, whatever. Oh, whatever. Let's head to Station Heights. Now, we can talk to her. I hope I can find some performers soon. I can't wait. The item shops now do have stuff. Items from previously visited shops. So this has a tent and uh, a tent and a potion there that we can get. We can also sell stuff if we so choose. This guy should also sell us some stuff. A hammer staff for the one, the only, Donald. And we also get an adamant shield. For Goofy. I'm actually going to pick up both of these just because why not, right? We we can. Oops. There we go. And we can go ahead, go into our uh our items. Uh Donald, we will equip him with the hammer staff, which will just increase his strength, which doesn't totally matter. And then for Goofy, we can go ahead and equip the Adamant Shield, which will increase his strength as well. Gnarly. Look at that. 200 200 money. We already did that. We can check out the Help Wanted, updating job info, please come back later. Hmm. Apparently we can't do as much as I thought we could do here right now. Which is, which is really sad. Have you come to find a job? I can't find any work that I can do. So apparently we don't have access to that. We can talk to this guy, how am I supposed to carry this stuff up to the garage? And he wants me to hurry? I never should have taken this job. We won't go up there just yet. There is, in fact, things that we can do. We have to go back to the woods. Into the woods, as they say. You know, Hammerstein. All that jazz. So back on the tram common, there are also things that we can do. You'll notice that this shop is actually closed now. Uh, apparently because Roxas isn't there anymore, they, they closed it down. They closed it. We got a potion right there. Remember, with Sora now, you can collect all of the treasures that are located here in Twilight Town, and I recommend you do. Right here, we can go ahead and talk to her. She will also have accessories for us, including the ability ring, which only increases your maximum AP by one. I don't really recommend picking it up. I just don't really think it's worth it right now, especially when you just don't have that many abilities. We can talk to these guys. 
that's not going to be a big deal. He's the one that wants us to go around and, and post posters. No, no big deal whatsoever. Right over here, we can get another chest that contains a one and only Mithril Shard, which of course we need for synthesizing. And then we can just jump over here, grab this treasure chest as well. Nice little handy, handy dandy bridge for us. Another Mithril Shard! Oh! And then we can actually just come down here. We do need to jump. We can't jump over. Oh, yeah, that's right. We can't actually get up on top of here yet to get that last that last treasure thing. We just, we don't have the jumps, the hops for it, you know? We don't have the hops for it. But right here, we can grab a potion. There's so many items around here, guys. Right down here, literally just drop down. We can pick up another high potion. Now, I'm going to actually circle back around because in this alleyway, there's actually some stuff that we can do as well. You can get onto these houses and jump across. Uh, I just don't know if you can actually... I'm pretty sure we can get up there. Um, just not an easy way. So watch out for bees! Don't worry, guys. We got... We got Donald, who can thunder bees to death. Thanks, Donald. We did it, guys. We did it. That was all you could actually find in here, which is kind of weird. But we can grab this chest, which has a tent. Worth getting, especially since there, there's so much money. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. That's not what I meant to do at all. Okay, let's see if we can do this again without without dropping. All right, we were able to hop, and now from here, you can actually just jump on this tiny little blue roof and then hop on over here, and we can get this chest. AP boost. Oh, so useful. That permanently raises the AP of a character that you use it on. Uh, I don't recommend using it yet. There's no real point. Again, you don't really have that many items, so or that many abilities, so you don't really need it. Now, you can jump up here as well, just to kind of explore a little bit more. I don't believe there's, though, any items or anything up here that you can get. We can come down here and see what's going on. There's nothing over here by the junk sweeper or trash sweeper. We can also just go ahead and look at the items that we've uh, attached over in the journal. You can actually look at treasures. Uh, so we are missing a few. We are missing... We're missing six. Obviously, we can't really get those yet. Um, there are some that will be attainable after you progress the story a little bit. But what we can do is we can go into the woods and grab the treasure chests that are here. And also, it looks like Vivi's here. Hey, Vivi, what are you doing, dude? Cypher's real strong, you know? Did I sound tough? Did I? Tough like Rye, you know? No, you didn't, Vivi. You didn't. Then we can grab a potion. And then right over here is another chest that we can grab. So we're already about to grab three new ones, which is pretty gnarly. So there's only three left. Another mithril shard. So many treasures. So many treasures. And right here, we can grab a high potion. The high potions are super useful. You will be using them during your playthrough, so getting them for free is pretty nice. You can head back to the mansion, but you're not going to be able to actually go into the mansion yet, um, if I'm not entirely mistaken. So this is, of course, where we woke up, and I'm pretty sure we can't go in. I'm going to check real quick, because you never know. Yeah, we've got stuff to do. All right, so I'm going to cut until we are back in Station Heights. Now that we're back in Station Heights, we can actually just walk all the way up back to the tram station. I gotta say, Donald's running animation is probably my favorite in the game, and maybe Goofy's just because his butt is out so far. Like, his butt is out, dude. He is, he is, he is lurching forward. Oh, this is not good. I was going to say, Sora doesn't quite know who these people are. Defeat all of the strange enemies. This is the first time that Sora has seen them, but not really. So we, we ignored that dusk. We killed that one. Ten experience each now, by the way. And, oddly enough, our reaction commands aren't coming up as often as they did before. Sora just hit level 7 and got an item boost, which means that we can, we can do stuff with items. 
All right, let's kill these creepers real quick. They now give six experience. Look how much damage that did just from that one dusk attack. I think we did get hit by the creeper for a second there, but we will just keep killing these dusk as much as we can. I recommend killing as many as you possibly can as fast as you can. Goofy leveled up. That's what I'm talking about, Goof Troop. All right, let's go ahead and kill these creepers. Oh, so many creepers that are just dead. Now, they are dropping MP and not health anymore or money, which is very, very interesting, uh, I think. The reason for that is so that you can't possibly fight this fight forever. Eventually, you're going to lose. Eventually. Not anytime soon, though, because we are Sora. And Sora is just the bee's knees, man. Just the bee's knees. And Sora gained another level while we were fighting. We hit level 8. Magic increased and maximum AP increased. Oh, no. We're overwhelmed, dude. Yo, Mickey, my dude. Your Majesty. Shh. You gotta board the train and leave town. The train knows the way. Here. Your Majesty. The king. Was that really him? It could have been. Yep, I know it was. Now we know he's okay. The king was locked in the realm of darkness, right? Uh-huh. But we just saw him. Yep. And if the king is here, that means Riku's here. He's gotta be. Well, I'm gonna go look for Riku. Then he and I can go back to the islands together. Kyrie's there waiting for us. What are you two gonna do? Worse, <laughs> Sora, do you have to ask? Hey, what's so funny? Your face. <laughs> <laughs> What do you say, guys? Let's stick together for one more journey. To where again? We have to board the train. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Come on. And we get the money pouch, a pouch from the king. There's 5,000 money inside for some reason. Crystal orb. A pretty crystal, it sparkles brightly when held up to the sun. Secret Ansem Report 2. A secret report written by Ansem, it can be viewed in Gemini's journal. Oh. Oh, heck yeah. Wait up! Huh? Hey, Sora? What? Nothing, but... We came to see you off. It just seemed like something we ought to do. Oh. Really? Thanks. You should hurry and get your tickets. Right. Huh? Why not one? They're the same. Yeah. Three tickets, please. can't help feeling like we won't see this town again. Why not? You're thinking too much. Yeah, you're right. Huh. Like we won't see the town again. Sorry I was so cold before. Something's been bugging me. We may not see each other for a while. Take care of yourself, okay? Oh, oh okay, Andrew Garfield, that we've never met before. That we just have never even met. You smell? That's weird. I feel like I should see you off for some reason. Like, I have to say goodbye to somebody I've been waiting a long time to see. This is going to be a long journey, so prepare yourself. Not yet. Not yet. You can talk to Donald to leave? 
But we don't want to do that because we have three last treasure chests that we need to get here in Twilight Town. Let's hope the third one is here. Right there, we got a high potion. Right here, we'll get a tent. And then the third one should be on the other side. Yep. Oh, yeah. So we got all of the treasures that we can get in this early portion of Twilight Town now that we're Sora. Look at that. Mithril Shard. If we go ahead and look at our journal, we will see treasures. All of them. Hell, yeah. All right. Let's continue on. I recommend using the save point here, if nothing else, than just to, you know, record your progress. Uh, you don't have to worry about anything coming up. There's no, like, real dangers or anything approaching. Um, Sora, about that bag of yours, uh, never mind. Come visit us, all right? We'll be at the usual spot. Okay. All right, now let's talk to Donald, and let's... Let's skadoodles. Let's get on that train. Okay. Let's go. Bye. Hey, Sora. You sure we haven't met before? Positive. Why do you ask? I don't know. Huh? You okay? It, yeah. Don't know where it came from. Pull it together. Right. See ya. Roxas came through a little there. Oh, that's so sad. It's almost like Roxas is stuck inside of Sora, but he's not. Like, Roxas doesn't exist anymore. Does he? Dude, your clothes shrunk, man. Welcome to the space train. It's all right. Welcome to the space train. Guess that's that. Let's go. Go where? It's not like we have homes to return to. We don't exist, remember? Yes, it's true. We may not have homes. But there is some place I want to go. And someone I want to see. Same here. So, you think you might let us go? I know you're here to get rid of us, but... Diz wants to get rid of me? Go. You sure about this? I owe you both. For what? Castle Oblivion. You helped us. <laughs> you don't have to tell me twice. Thank you. Nominate runs like a doofus.
Riding the space train. I love this music, dude. So good. Say goodbye to the space train. <laughs> there goes our ride. Welcome to the tower here in Twilight Town? Apparently, we're still in Twilight Town. Tell me how that one works. So I highly recommend that you grab these chests before you proceed any further because you will not be able to grab them for some time if you proceed further. So let's go ahead, grab these, grab all of these, all of these great things. We got a potion, a high potion, and an ether. I believe that's all of the ones that we can actually get here. And then we can approach this guy. What's going on? <laughs> I sent some of my lackeys inside to see if the master of this here tower's as big and tough as they say. Word is he's a real powerful sorcerer, which would make him the perfect bodyguard for me. See, it don't matter how tough he is. Once he's a heartless, he'll do as I say. Uh-huh, well... That's right. They're those things that come out of the darkness in folks' hearts. Why, with all those heartless at her side, my dear friend Maleficent is gonna conquer everything. And since I got me a debt to pay, I'm going round to a bunch of different worlds and building an army of heartless, special for her. Oh, why am I talking to you pipsqueaks anyway? Go on, Scram, I'm behind schedule as it is. You ought to find something nicer to do. Oh, says who? Huh? Oh, it's you! Pete? What are you two Nimrods doing here? What are you doing here? You know him? We sure do. Pete's been causing trouble for ages. His Majesty banished him to another dimension a long time ago. I wonder how he escaped. <laughs> you want to know how, eh? Well, Maleficent busted me out, that's how. And now your world, no, 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 all the worlds are gonna belong to yours truly. Cause uh, Maleficent's gonna help me conquer them. Maleficent, huh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what are you laughing at? Why, Maleficent's power is so great that- She's toast. Huh? Sorry, but Maleficent can't help you now. What do you mean? <laughs> You! So you're the ones that did it! Well, we might have had something to do with it. Heartless Squad, round up! That's it? Some shadows? Defeat all of the Heartless, our first Heartless here in Kingdom Hearts 2. Feels good to be fighting uh, familiar enemies that we, we all know and love. Oh, I love how they look in 60 frames per second. So strong. So strong. Good job, Donald. You just wait. Nobody, and I do mean nobody, messes with the mighty Pete. So mighty Pete. Who lives in this tower anyway? Oh, you don't know, eh? Well, it's old Yen Sid. Of course, he's probably a heartless by now. Master Yen Sid lives here? Yen Sid is the king's teacher. Wow, sounds powerful. Whoa, 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 whoa. Guys, Pete is the best villain to ever be introduced in anything ever. I love Pete. I love Pete. He brings a whole new level of comedic love. That's all I have to- love. Brings a whole new level of comedic love. Pete's a little late to the party. We already defeated Maleficent. We sure darn did. I never expected to run into Pete here. To think he's not just messing around with our world, but here too. Interesting stuff. 
In the next episode, we will continue up these staircases to discover the mighty Yin Sid, the teacher of King Mickey. And then we'll see what happens. Hopefully we get a change of clothes or something soon because we look redonkulous. We look redonkulous. Thank you all for watching so much. If you like the video, make sure you drop a like on it. It helps the channel out, helps these videos out, lets me know that you guys enjoyed it. Showing up on screen right now is a video that contains the playlist for all of Kingdom Hearts 2 and a video that YouTube has chosen specifically for you. There's also my face. You can click on that to subscribe if you haven't already. And there is also a Patreon button so you can support the channel monetarily. A dollar a month means early access to videos. Thank you all for watching and remember, never give up. Never surrender to the darkness.